Let's take a look how to make this dope wavy text effect here in Photoshop. Let's go down here, select solid color and select the color for the background. Click OK. Select the type tool. By the way, I went with the archival black italic. Select the text, press Ctrl T, press and hold Shift, rotate it 90 degrees, press and hold Shift, scale it up until it's gonna fit perfectly and position it on the right side. Press and hold Alt, drag it to the right, also press Shift to isolate. I'm gonna put it something like this. Press and hold Alt again, duplicate again until you're gonna fill up the artboard. There you go. Delete the background, press and hold Shift, select all the layers, right click. Convert a smart object. And now we're gonna go to the filter, distort and select a wave. And here is where the magic happens. You can increase the number of the generators. You can distort it more or less. As you can see, it is creating waves horizontally and vertically at the same time. So we're gonna decrease this a little bit. So the text is gonna be visible. At the wavelength, the minimum is somewhere around 600. Uh, this is gonna create some really nice distortions. So if I bring it down, it's gonna make it normal. If I bring it up it is going to distort it in a really nice uh, way i think this is the sweet spot somewhere around 650 60 and the amplitude the minimum and maximum is somewhere around see that so if i increase it the maximum it is going to create waves horizontally and vertically on an extreme level so i'm going to need to decrease it if you decrease it too much it's going to be boring so i suggest you go with a lower value and now let's go to the scale. So this would be the scale. Again, this is going to make it normal. And yeah, this is the horizontal and the bottom is the vertical. So as you can see, it's straightened out, but I want to distort it more. And yeah, pretty much these are it. From here, I'm gonna click OK. If you are not satisfied, you also can double click here on the thumbnail and it's gonna open up the text that you created. You can press and hold Shift, select all the text, press Control T, you know, and just scale it or rotate it, you know, do something. Some new stuff double click release and from here you're gonna go to the file click on save and as you can see here we got two tabs so this is the new tab open you can go back with the liquid and it's gonna make a way better effect this way you can test out experiment with it but I kind of like it like this now I also can go to filter blur gallery and select field blur add some blur on some areas maybe here at the center is gonna be sharp this also I can add some blur here maybe. And when you're satisfied, you can click OK up here. I want to rotate this in a landscape position, but if I do it right now, it is going to distort it. So I'm gonna go right click on the layer, convert to smart object again. And now let's go to the image, image rotation, and click on 90 degree clockwise. And there you go. Thanks for watching. <laughs>